Pakistan. It is going to be an absolute beauty. Nice drive. That's a solid blow. And uh, that will be first four for Pakistan. Courtesy Tafi Koma. Crashing shot. That was hit uh, with massive power. Good timing. So Ashish Nehra starting uh, a little wide outside the off stump and paying the price. It's well played, nice and straight. That's a good shot. Didn't try and hit it too hard. Bad on ball. Good timing. The outfield is just a little bit on the slow side. It's going to make it though. Important boundary that one. He's a very good talent, Tofi Kumar. And I was surprised not to see him playing for the Pakistani team to start with in this World Cup. Beautifully played once again. Hitting the ball in the up and getting the ball in the right area. Beautiful start from these openers. Two boundaries in the over, five balls in the over now and uh, Nero just getting a little bit of treatment here. Obviously the two openers out there, their partnership is now 51. So had his timber disturbed that is a huge wicket that's the first one down and the Indian supporters and the players obviously are ecstatic well for the first time these Indians they are back into this game short ball he's gone for it he's hit it beautifully that is a very very good shot just the one bouncing over the rope gee pick that up quickly like you said Hazy that was a brilliant stroke Good stroke, square of the wicket. Excellent shot from Abdul Razak. Good shot. That'll run away for four. Excellent stroke and irritating for the bowler because it was the last ball of the over. 80 for one. Yes, and that's a brilliant catch. Out of the blue. Rahul Dravid has taken a stunner. Ashish Nehra picks up the second wicket. And the stumps. Gone over the top. First ball that is faced. One bounce and then trickles onto the boundary rope. You said about his walk, Amir, the way he walked in today. Just looks different in Zamam. Embarrassing record. Just the 10 runs. Or oh, there could be a run out here. Good throw and good throw. The finger goes up, and yet again we see in Zamamul Haq being run out. He would be devastated. The Indians are ecstatic, so are the supporters. To well played nice and fine. Third man has got some work to do. He's not going to get there. That is very well played. Anil Kumla it was. He couldn't get across, but a fine shot to finish the over, get things back on track for Pakistan. Beautiful shot, but out, clipped off his pads, and just as uh, Ramiz and I were talking about the importance of Yusuf Johanna staying out there, he's chipped one straight down deep square leg's throat. There it is, his 20th one day international century, and I guess if you're going to get 100, get 100 against India, in an atmosphere such as this. What an outstanding innings. Ball in. Clean him up. Lovely Yorker from Ashish Nehra. Indians were looking for a breakthrough and they've got it in the 40th over. And the Indian flags are out. And moment to enjoy. Well, he's had a bit of luck, but he's got four for it. And I guess that's all that matters. 200 comes up. Here we go. But it's gone up too high. It hasn't got the distance on it. There's two under it. It's safely caught. Brave, but clever. And, more importantly, successful. Well, just as we were querying why Saurabh Ganguly has got the Nesh Mongia bowling, well, we know the answer now. He's picked up a wicket in that of Shahid Afridi. That's a good hit. A lovely hit inside out. 
one bounce over the rope. And a nice way to end the over for Rashid Latif. 235 for six. Towards extra cover. He's gone after the baller in that particular region. Four runs. That's a very good stroke from Rashid Latif. Backing away towards the leg stump and picking up a boundary. He's a very handy player to have in your lineup. Goes for the big one. Dinesh Mongia coming underneath it. And uh, he takes it comfortably. So in the quest of trying to get some quick runs, Yunus Khan has been dismissed. You cannot blame Bl uh, Yunus Khan. That's well played. Powerfully struck. Beats the man at deep point. Just what Pakistan wanted this stage. Akram getting the boundary. And this is a good finish. Excellent stroke from Vaseem Akram. Ball of the Pakistan innings. And again, beautifully placed. And this is a terrific finish for Pakistan. Consecutive boundaries will take them to 273. And that is a score they'll settle for after winning the toss and deciding to bat first. And especially after they lost three quick wickets in the later part of the innings. They have done well. Pakistan will be well pleased with that after 50 overs. 273 for seven. The star of the show was Saeed Amwa. 101 off 126 deliveries including seven fours. And a good innings also from Yunus Khan with 32. Rashid Latif was superb with the tail. 29 off for 25 and the last over 15 runs coming in the last five overs 47 runs so in the end after 50 273 for seven now if we look at the Indian bowling figures well there was uh, just a couple of guys picking up wickets Zahir picked up two for 46 and uh, Nira picked up uh, two for 74 he was expensive today the only one who really got some tap and the fifth bowler duties were shared by Ganguly, Sawag and Mongia just going for 52 runs and picking up a wicket. So uh, a reasonable performance by most of the Indian bowlers. And the target is India need 274 runs. They've got 50 overs available, of course, and they've got to go at just under 5.5 to the over. That's another six. Short, wide. This time it's Sivak with the uppercut. Boy, this ball has gone a long way. You don't hear see sixes in that direction. But <laughs> Turned away on the onside. This outfield is picking up. A boundary to end the over. 11 runs coming off it. After four overs, India 39 for no loss. In the air, taken. Bakar Yunus getting the ball pitched up. Seva going on the drive, hitting it up Ishli. Afridi making no mistake. And Pakistan draw first blood. That's <laughs> wrapped on the pads. That is close. He's a kick up. That was always going to be out. Caught on the crease. A double break here for Pakistan. And they're right back in it. Fantastic piece of bowling from Wakar Yunus. 2.73. It's always going to be a competitive score. Unless you bowl long ups like that and get it for four. Yes! Bowl him out. Inside edge, I think. But the breakthrough Pakistan needed now. Can they capitalise on that? Wakar Yunus calling the men in. As Mohamed Kaif makes his way to the pavilion. He's on 98, 98 not out, Tendulkar. Short ball, quick ball, might be out, is out. Shah Bakhtar has come back into the attack. The first ball that Tendulkar has faced when he's got a runner, he's been dismissed. Shah Bakhtar, that was a very, very quick delivery, just under 150 k's per hour, took him by surprise, and he's on his way back. What, the, what an end, what a dramatic end to a magnificent knock from Sachin Tendulkar. Going around the wicket at pace. That's a very, very good shot. That's not a bad way to get off the mark. Four runs to get things going for Yuvraj Singh. Seven runs off the over, but the important wicket of Sachin Tendulkar. 181 for four. 
That's driven handsomely through the offside. Jovras doesn't bother to run. And that's a trademark cover drive from the left-hander. Thank you, Ravi. As we see that one uh, go away to the boundary, so uh, Indians now moving uh, very, very nicely. That is a fine strike. Just eased it through the covers for four. Very, very well played. And the flags are flying all over the show. And also the boundaries. Exquisite timing. Two more required now. Rahul Dravid on strike. He's on 40. The partnership's worth 95. Trouble. Has he put it away? Yes, he has. That's it. India have done it. A boundary to finish things. The crowd here at Supersport Park, Centurion are going absolutely berserk. What a terrific performance by India. Rahul Dravid, a very sensible knock from him. Sarah Ganguly is getting all the accolades off the field. And interaction from the players, Pakistanis, big smiles and shaking the hands of Rahul Dravid and Yuvraj Singh. The end of what has been a classic encounter. It's been a terrific game of cricket. And India win by six wickets. 273 for seven off their 50 overs. Amwar was outstanding with his 100. And India in reply, 276 for four. Tendulkar, what a treat that was. He was also the man of the match today, which was no surprise to anybody. And India won by six wickets.